welcome back to the channel i am valitra and i am the crafty black girl so in this video you guys i am going to show you guys this gift basket that i did and this is a mani petty gift basket but it's not a basket it's an unbasket if you don't know what an unbasket is i'm gonna need you to head over to birth and bosses with felicia and she will explain what an unbasket is but for now i'm just showing you guys what i did with this basket and as you see this little charger plate it came with a little bit of imperfection and that's why i got them so cheap but i didn't want that to show i didn't want it to take away from the basket and look horrible so i went ahead and used these stickers i cut out with my cricut maker and there we have it and so i'm just gonna add one more little heart so when they take the things off of this charger plate they probably can use it for something else so we covered that up and this is the gift set that i'm going to use it's a manicure gel nail polish and i got this for seven dollars at city trends i thought this was a nice little gift set and i like to use gift sets because it's just they're already put together and they look nice but this one i did have to pop open because some of the things had fallen and i did not want to display it that way first of all thing came out of the top that's supposed to hang on the rack so i put that back in of course i'm gonna tape it back in with some clear shipping tape so you know nothing bulky or um that you can tell that i did that you know and then i put the nail file back in place and i just try to make sure that i do this when i get these sets because sometimes the things fall out and they look they just look bad so i popped all the little tape off and now i'm going to cover those areas of course with the same little hearts that i put on the plate you will see that i use these a lot during valentine's day and they saved me because i use those for the barcodes as well as for resealing things and adding decorations so that was kind of like my little trademark so now i'm just going to tape this down to the actual charger plate so that it's pretty sturdy and as you can see i already put the chocolate hearts in the front i actually glued those to the gift box and then now i have this pretty feet uh gift box that came from city trends as well this was not on sale that was on clearance this one was not this one was five dollars and so i just set it to the side so that you can kind of see the little gift bag to put your items in and everything's not covered up so i just you know i like to funk things up a little bit and turn them to the side and not just put them like straight so i just put that to the side glued it to not glued it i'm sorry i taped it to the front of the gift box and added the same little trinket box from the last video where i did the makeup uh makeup unbasket so i really like these little trinket boxes i got that from dollar tree a dollar 25 and you can put little stuff in it i don't know what they would put in it but it was cute to me so that's why i put it in there so last thing i'm gonna do is season my basket i told y'all i always like to add a little seasoning and that is basket seasoning which is glitter <laughs> so when i talk about basket seasoning or seasoning my basket i mean adding a little touch of glitter when they open it i mean i love glitter so i would love to open a gift with glitter on it i'm just that's just me i don't know but now i am angling my scissors and cutting the top i wrap this with um 30 by 24 shrink wrap bag i cut the bag as i've done in pre previous videos to make it fit and of course i taped the back all of the excess and then my bow came off so i just had to figure out a way i went ahead and just wrapped it tighten it boom bam and we were good so i didn't have to take the whole thing apart as you can see i just added some more curling string and went ahead and curled it to add it back in we're good so i'm actually super loving these bows if y'all have not you know watched this bow video which i know most of you have so watch the bow video because it helped me out a lot it really helped me out a lot i just have to get some more colors but yeah i really love both so now i'm just tacking down the bottom and we are doing the shrink wrap i'm using my blow dryer just to put everything in place i actually really liked this basket um let's see i spent seven dollars um five dollars that's twelve dollars fifty cents on the charger plate um, i would say a dollar for the shrink wrap maybe fifty cents for the bow um so under 15 dollars, and i would sell this basket for about 60 dollars is what this gift basket would go for so i'm going to try to remember to include the prices that i paid for items as well as what i would sell it for so that you guys can have an idea of how much you know where to even start with the price so 
yeah this basket was a 60 dollar basket and i just wanted to show you guys what it looks like so i always make sure i go with my shrink wrap i do put my blow dryer already on there it i mean all the way on there it doesn't like stop or anything like that but it probably should <laughs> but this is what it's looking like you guys a mani pedi gift basket um perfect for valentine's mother's day or just a birthday whatever you know we would just switch out that chocolate and put something else there and you could use this for whatever need you may have so thank you all so much for watching i appreciate it until next time i will see y'all later okay bye